don't understand a fixation on the town. I was born there. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols. And humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or we allow the Mongols to take it. Domoe wins a victory and lets her guard down. Then we strike. Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it! Tomoe would agree, Sensei. Fine, Sakai. But you will attack from the north. We should focus our efforts there. Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and... Listen! Did you hear that? One arrow, one death. I wondered when Tomoe's new friends would visit. If the point was to kill us, she would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Hyoshi Springs, the attack is starting. This way. fall today. Promise me, you will keep hunting Tomoe. I promise, Sensei. She knows you're my student. Your death will destroy my legacy. Your way of the bow will survive with me. Where will Tomoe strike? In the back town, near the waterfalls, the most vulnerable point. If we get there before the Mongols, we can prepare a defense, but it won't be easy. It never is. You two, come here. What is it, my lords? Mongols are heading for Hiroshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lords. Good sight lines over here. The Mongols won't be able to flank us. We don't have much time. What can we use to our advantage? Not many options. We'll exploit the ones we have. Hornet's nests. Excellent distraction. Dry grass. Lure the Mongols in. We'll make sure you have flaming arrows. Those barrels could do some damage. Take these flaming arrows, and try not to burn yourself or me. Then don't get in my way, Sensei. Get ready. The Mongols will be here soon. They're getting closer. Good. Let's demonstrate the way of the bow for them. They're coming downhill. Take them. One arrow, one death, Sensei.
not bad. I'm ready for more. So are they. Coming down the main road. I've, I've got them. Sign of Tomoe. Sure. More on the way. Help them cross the Sanshu River. now. There she is. That's Tomoe? Burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Oh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion to seize the clan and lost, but only after butchering Lord Nagao's best men. Hironori didn't die fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convinced myself the way of the bow had to survive. 
But the truth is, I am a coward who should have ended it long ago. You told Tomoe all of this. I wanted her to understand what it meant for me to teach again. And like everything else, she turned it against me. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago. And you won't change Tomoe. But today, you saved the people of Hiyoshi Springs. With my new student. I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours. But Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. Lord Sakai, I studied poetry with your uncle. The Mongols have taken Lord Shimura captive. Mm. He will endure. He is strong and resilient, skilled in the art of combat and poetry. Do you practice haiku, my lord? There is no time during war. War is the reason to make time. Haiku allows one to concentrate, eliminate chaos. To find peace. Precisely. My favorite place to write lies atop the cliff. It is one of many such places. If you look, you will find inspiration all across Tsushima. I hope I can find quiet places like this one, untouched by war. Look for the birds. They will show you the way.
the stars. A sturdy defense. The old man was right. My spirit feels at peace, strong. I should compose more poems. Do you know the tale of Tadayori, my lord? I know his name, but I've not heard of his exploits. It's long believed the Ama Tadayori war granted him great power, that it would be disastrous should it fall into the wrong hands. Then I can't let that happen. I'd like to hear more of this story, and this armor. The musician Yamato may be able to help. He told me the legend in Azumo, near the river that separates it from Sutsu. Come, my lord. The story of Uchitsune awaits. Long ago, an emperor and his palace were plagued by a winged demon. The emperor sent for Uchitsune, the most renowned archer of his time, who wielded a bow blessed by a kami. When the demon next came, Uchitsune was ready, long bow in hand. His aim was truer, and his arrows flew farther than any archers in Japan. Uchitsune loosed a single arrow. It pierced the demon's heart. As it fell to the ground, it cursed Uchitsune with its final breath. Soon after, Uchitsune saw the forms of the demon everywhere. His legendary bow never missed, but each arrow that hit its mark was met with a very human scream. The trail of bodies led to his capture. Though many called for Uchitsune's death, the Emperor felt pity for him. Uchitsune was banished to Tsushima Island. He died years later, alone and forgotten by all but a few. The demon slaying Longbow has remained hidden here since his passing. Some say it awaits a worthy master. Others believe it still holds the demon's curse. Curse or not, the bow sounds powerful. Take care, my lord. The bow inspires darkness in those who seek it. I'll bear that in mind. The question is where to begin looking. To quiet his mind, Uchitsune often walked the coast, obsessed with the blue hydrangeas that grew there. Perhaps they'll provide a clue.
Blue hydrangeas, like the musician mentioned. I must be close. Huh. Strange. That tomb is cracked open. An island surrounded by blue flowers. Which is in this bowl could be there. Which is in this resting place. Stop searching for the cursed bow. It leads only to death. He wore the mask of a Tengu demon. And that was a warning shot. Can't let my guard down.
Hostile normal. May the slain find peace. Hmm. <laughs> 